All I want for Christmas is to sell my home. Does that sound like you? Can you believe that we're entering the holiday season? I feel like it was just 2022 and we were raising our glasses for a toast. Hi, I'm Krista Mayshire of Homes by Krista and eXp Realty. As a seller, you may be asking yourself, is it a wise time to sell my home during the holidays? In real estate, this is typically the slowest month of the year for buyers and sellers. However, if you are a homeowner that has to sell right now, maybe it's because of a job relocation or a divorce, or maybe the current size of your home no longer meets your needs, here are a few key points that you may want to actually consider when you're actually making the decision. Number one, you'll be getting one step ahead of other sellers. Typically, most owners will wait until the new year before listing their home because of the hustle and bustle of what's happening during the holiday season. All the shopping, the gatherings, Christmas, you name it. However, listing your property now will give you the opportunity to get ahead of the competition. Number two, you'll be getting in front of serious buyers and not just looky-loos. Most buyers searching for homes during the holiday season are typically very, very serious. They are not just looky-loos or just curious on what's actually happening in the market. They actually are serious buyers if they're looking right now during the holiday season. By listing your property during the holiday months, you have the advantage of actually being in front of a buyer who is eager to make a purchase before the end of the year. Number three, you are in a better position to move up. Remember, it is easy to get distracted with all the hustle and bustle of the holidays, so do not lose sight of why you need to sell your home in the first place. Maybe it's because you need a bigger space or a better location for your kids to go to school. Also keep in mind that today's sellers are in a better position to move up due to the amount of equity in their home now. According to CoreLogic, the average amount of equity per mortgage holder has actually climbed to an all-time high of $300,000, which also means they were much less likely to have another crash. And I hope this information was helpful. And remember, if you want the real nitty gritty on the latest, most recent current market analysis or information, feel free to reach out to my team and I at any time and we are here to help. And remember, when you do what you love, people love what you do. So give us a call.